At one of the most critically eroded coastlines on the first coast is getting some relief. A $20 million project just got underway this weekend. Zach Wilcox is on your side. He joins us live from the north end of Volano Beach. And Zach, how much sand is actually getting pumped on the shore? Hey, Anthony, about 2 million tons. Can you believe that? That's uh, I thought that my cake that I had for dessert last night was heavy. How about that? 2 million tons. You can see the uh, ship that's out there, the dredge that's scooping up all that sand, pumping it onto the shore. And then there's a lot of machines down here that are then kind of maneuvering it, filling back in the berm. After they finish doing that, they're going to go back through and plant some sea oats in there, really try and enrich that soil or enrich that sand and kind of make that a strong berm, and hopefully protect everything behind the berm. Now they actually did a similar project like this two years ago, but after we had Nicole and we had Ian and all those nor'easters earlier this year, well, a lot of that sand that they packed in here washed away. So this time they're doing it even bigger and better, even more sand, 2 million tons, as I mentioned, to hopefully last for about five years before they need to do any future renourishments and need to pack it back in again. And this is, of course, to protect everything behind the dunes, but also uh, to protect the environment in this area. It creates or reinforces shoreline environment for sea turtles, for marine, sh um, marine shorebirds, marine life. And one of the one of the reasons that they just got started with this now, speaking of sea turtles, is that they had to take a couple of months there. The state wildlife agents came in and moved all the turtle nests out of. Volano Beach that way no turtles would be destroyed by this process and all these heavy machines here so they all moved out and you're going to see scenes like this one behind me uh, for the next six months or so until spring when they're hoping to wrap it up they're starting here on the north end of Volano Beach working their way about three miles south of Surfside Park in Volano Beach Zach Wilcox First Coast News on your side.